Hi guys, so today we will be discussing Reverb Nation, a social media for uh, music lovers as well as artists. So uh, in my past video, uh, I said that I was lucky to have these guys as my clients, Faces of Failure. So if you're into heavy metal music, uh, I urge you to like their page at F of Failure. That's your Facebook page. So um, when managing pages in Facebook, you can do a lot of things. However, there are certain limitations. Some of them uh, attaching music in their Facebook page. So when I first got access to this page, there were no, there were limitations actually. So there is no band profile tab here. So, okay, let's just check this out. If you click, if you click the band profile, it will redirect your to the API of Reverb Nation where yes whatever you have uploaded in Reverb Nation you uh, they can be streamed here so for example let me just uh, maximize this one here we have one song uploaded and we can actually pin this one here as their main feature of this page so we can actually download the song here and we can also share your profile or the specific page okay so let's take a look at reverb nation you can log in and create your own account at www.reverbnation.com so when you've succeed, uh, successfully logged in you are required to select an account so for me I have I have many accounts I manage two bands actually it's Monster Bean Society and now Faces of Failure so let's dig in click the access account button <coughs> Oh, so oh. let me just log in first. Oh, what's wrong? There's something wrong. I actually can't log in. I'm having technical difficulties. No, I can't access the. Okay, let me try this tab. Okay, good thing I have a backup. However, this is for Monster Bean Society. So um, when you've successfully logged in, let me just maximize this one. You'll be redirected to your profile. So your profile tab acts as your dashboard too, where you can see here we have the admin panel where we can um, customize our profile. So for we can distribute um, a specific album or set of songs. You can also increase your reach with your fans and of course um, uh, 
widen the exposure of the band. So we also have here analytics, uh, recommendations too. You can upload songs, photos, you can customize and input details of demand members. Also, you can upload videos as well. So, like what I've said earlier, um, Reverb Nation is just like the Facebook for rock stars, actually. So, you can upload profile photos, uh, cover photos. So, for Monster Bean Society, they have one two three four five six seven eight nine i think i guess nine songs uploaded as well so they can oh the the bio has not been updated so you can add shows you can upload photos you can manage your community customize the featured video okay let me click the dashboard again like what i said earlier the dashboard in the profile it's it's just the same actually also here we have um, the recommendations so we can click uh, some artists we may know so the happy arts club i think i know them yes we can connect with them Next one, so content. We can customize the profile. We've done that. We can upload songs, customize album, shows. Okay, let's try songs. So the good thing, uh, the good thing about Reverb Nation is they let you uh, use their free services. However, uh, you have the option to uh, boost. Uh, the reach of your songs what else um, you can also up to stream on Spotify and other um, services so let's take a look at this one. I'm having trouble with my internet connection. Back again. And click that. So you may opt to release an album, or of course, you can do this by single. So if you select all retailers, so we have Spotify, iTunes, Google Play, Pandora, and others, even YouTube. So the cost is $19.95. So for single packages, let's try this one. So if you're only selecting probably a uh, Spotify so you'll have to be a dollar per year and then we'll click next so you have to <clears throat> supply the details click the next button again drag the song here so um this will be the um what to call this limit of the this part of the tutorial because we need to actually upload quality songs uh, the songs uploaded here are just uh, demo quality songs so i think uh, the option here is you can select up to um, 300 plus kbps of quality of songs so i think you are not allowed to upload songs with um, 9 MB of size. Okay. What else? 
also add songs again. Again, there's there's something wrong with my browser. Let me right click that one. I don't know. Let's just skip that. Okay, next album. So we can create another album if this band records another one. Okay, let's just edit their existing one. So if you have uploaded songs that are not present in any album, you can select them here. You can also rearrange the content of the album too. Also, we can delete, delete the album as well. So let's just uh, not click on that button. What other features should be discussed? So we also have the blog, comments, press for the tools. Yes, again, as I have discussed earlier, you can customize your fan reach, your distribution. You can also build your own website here. So actually, all of the things that you need for managing a rock, rock band or a musician, the social media accounts of these um, people, they are all combined in one platform in Reverb Nation. Of course, as long as you have the funds to pay for this, you're in tip top shape. What else can we do here? Actually, um, there are a lot of opportunities, so being sent by Reverb Nation as well, so let's take a look at this one. Yeah, they'll send you emails regarding music festivals, opportunities, opportunities where your band can play, where your band can submit songs, albums, make appearances, etc. etc. Okay, let's go back to the Facebook page. So again, uh, the default um, tabs or links in a Facebook page doesn't include band profile. So you have, uh, there is a way where you can link uh, Reverb Nation to the Facebook and automatically this tab magically appears. When I click this one, so for the faces of failure uh, this would be the particular oh yeah the song automatically played this would be what faces of failure should aim for let me just pause that so um we have combinations of songs here so Seven of them are just for sharing and streaming, and two of them, you can download these songs. Let me just click on this one. So if you want to track, there are certain features such as analytics. Keep track of history, too. Okay. Let me check this one. Stats. So, I guess that's the first song. Yeah, 218 plays, downloads 50. We have extra. We have 57 downloads and 290 plays. That seems to be decent. So, the other songs were just uploaded two days ago. So, there are no downloads. There are only or this song has 16 plays 
this one has 11 this one has 22 this is 15 this is 16 oh, this one, 40. yeah what else can we do here so I think there's there is a little bit of redundancy here where um, River Nation uh, also lets you view uploaded videos from River Nation. The redundancy is, yeah, you have the videos tab already present here. What else? Oops, you can also view the shows here. Also, you can download um, apps for Reverb Nation. Um, there is a Reverb Nation for uh, artists and Reverb Nation for discoverers. So, actually, they divided that into two. So, um, probably two years ago, you can only just download one. Yeah. I guess this covers up what we need to discuss today. So again, I'm Brian. I'm from Dice Social. I also play in uh, Monster Bean Society. So please do like and share the social media accounts of Dice Social. If you're into pop punk, please like and share Monster Bean Society at Facebook. Download their songs, stream their songs, I don't care. So, this is it. Good night, y'all.